you know, Hamza just made a video. No, he didn't make a video. It was like a while ago now. It was three months ago. The key to becoming mentally tougher, and I'm watching it three months after for the first time, and I'm thinking to myself, at the action step he's giving me, I'm thinking to myself, he's telling me like to basically sit down and relax and think about. Not necessarily relax, but think about all the things that you you fucked up on, all the mistakes you've made that you shouldn't have made, and you should have avoided. Like to me, for what it is like I'm trying, I'm copying some um, files to my USB so I can edit them into content because I'll increase my content ability. I'm also trying to turn on my computer and free up space here. So I've got w way too much going on over here in my setup. Way too much. Way, way, way too much. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> it's, kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of really annoying. And I got the monitor up there, which is a project I need to work on. I need to fix it. I, if I have time, I can fix it. The monitor there is a slight bug on there. I can. It works. Pause. Tissue, man. The tissue is for blowing my nose. Pause, guys. Pause. 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 And I'm just thinking to myself, like, the amount of time I'm wasting on video games, especially this morning. I've been, like, probably, like, two, three, four hours on video games, and then clipping up here along the way, I think, and rationalizing, saying to myself, oh, but I'm doing it for content. When I already have so much content. The video, the title of the video will be where I messed up. And it will be mostly on my productivity schedule. Like I haven't been as productive as I'd like to be, and I keep adding tasks to my to my to do list, to my to do list, and then my to do list becomes immensely, immensely congested. And then before you know it, there's so much work I need to do. It's like it's quite overwhelming. And then I get my friend on my dick just saying shit like, "Oh, you time manage? <laughs> Shut up, man. Shut up." And he's saying, "Wait, well, where else you messed up?" I think that rationalizing on myself and saying, oh, "I need to get more content," is stupid. Like, uh, my, I, how do I say this? Initial idea with the PS4 was, I'm gonna take the content out, and then I'm gonna put it up on my USB, and then I'm gonna slowly process it all. What ends up happening is, I end up playing the game a bit. I spend more of my life, energy, my time, which is now I wish I can never get back on bullshit like the video games and I feel regret after, I feel pain after, I feel annoyance after but I have more content now but I already have 300 gigabytes worth of content I think it's close to maybe 300, uh, 160 gigabytes of OBS I think I'm like 200 gigabytes on the, the files overall I need to check it obviously again but I think it's close to 300 gigabytes worth of videos I need to process through it's like, when I'm cooking, you know when you cook chicken thighs, there's skin on the chicken thighs and then there's like a meat part. And you're supposed to cut it in between, so it looks like a little breast or a chicken breast part, and then you've got the chicken, um, kind of like, on the, on the meat part. Basically, I just cut them into two. I've like one chicken breast, like this big, and I take off the skin, I slice it into two. That's what I would ideally think. That is my idea of processing when it comes to cook, making chicken, so I can then marinate, etc, etc. I would, I think, use the same strategy to execute on video editing. So I bring the clips in, so that's the meat. I put it in the uh, thing. I put it in the video editing software, that's putting the meat in the board, that's taking the skin off, and then I start uh, doing my work, cropping, cropping away. With this analogy in mind, with the chicken cutting analogy in mind, for my video editing work and my overall work, I probably have over a thousand kilograms of chicken that I need to get through. And I only have a, few, a week or something, or two, three weeks to get through it all. Which is quite intense. And even recording this video just gives me more work <laughs> for me to do. <laughs> so that's where I that's where I messed up. Is giving myself too much work. And then whilst having too much work, I get intimidated by the mountain. I, the mountain seems too daunting. I need to underclock the CPU. I overclocked the CPU a while back when I wanted to watch it. It just, it just came pre overclocked. Now it's loud as fuck. It's pretty annoying. I'm trying to underclock it so. One, I can get a quieter PC. Two, 
I can focus more on work. No, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. So that's my um my big regret, like my where where I messed up. Another way I, I could say where I messed up. How does that make sense? There's 18 by 18. There's 20 minutes left. 10 minutes left. How how does that even make sense? Well, man. Another place where I messed up is wasting my time on people that will not change themselves. I really, I really, really am grateful for individuals like Joe Rogan, and Andrew, and Jordan Peterson almost for saying stuff like, "Yeah, don't waste the time of people that won't." attempt to change themselves because they won't and you can't really do anything about it it's bad if you just focus purely on yourself and you surround yourself with individuals that already have that go-getter mindset but then again they might have some dis this how do i say this disconnect because you guys aren't entirely the same etc 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 but yeah, that's why i messed up Definitely, that's definitely where I messed up. I think that not not being productive enough, giving myself too much work, not being harsh on myself enough, indulging into self uh, instant gratification like video games, social media. Not necessarily porn these days. Not really, no. But definitely, definitely video games. This this is crushing my soul, ladies and gentlemen. Like I like I'm saying to my friends I had to quickly apologize after I just left abruptly which I'm grateful for by the way I'm genuinely grateful for that just leaving abruptly in the the, the party chat so they're like almost 30 years old no disrespect they're almost, they're almost 30 and they're still playing games uh, by the time I'm 18 I, don't, I want to stop playing utterly not even 18 I want to stop now why 18 why must I wait two months and, and five days 10th of July why must I wait that long in order to want to quit video games, why can't I just quit now instead? Wouldn't it be more productive for me to quit now and then, you know, quit while I'm ahead and focus on more uh, important things that will make me more happy? I'm stupid. You're just stupid. This piece is loud as fuck. <laughs> it's really loud. I need to go to the BIOS and then turn off the CPU that way, it's just it's really annoying. And my lab is being loud as well. That's where I messed up. You know, I wanted it pre overclock because I thought it would be good. But it turns out the lifespan of the CPU actually drastically decreases when it's pre overclocked. It's quite annoying. I keep seeing planes, man. You guys see that? Oh, really fast. It's quite a low plane, it's really fast. This idea of who wants to be somewhere else is plaguing my soul, admittedly. I know I should be somewhere else, I shouldn't be here. Like, I keep getting pulled back into it, you know, here. I was thinking about getting rid of my bed frame because it's actually really, really 